Just get your stuff done, Maya. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. I've had enough of this place. Did you gather up the supplies? I'm hoping. Oh, we're out of bags of chips. This is not good. But we've got painkillers. Here you go. Just casually strut to the car. Alright, come on, Maya. I got my beater mobile. What happened to Swag Mobile? It's dead. It died. Come on, Maya. I turn on the lights. Honk, honk. Honk, honk. Honk, honk. Do you, uh, you ready for pickup? Huh? Huh? You want a little pickup? Maya? You look like the kind of person who can use a little bit of a pickup. We got Zed on top of this more container. Get out here. I don't even know what she's doing. But you're dead. Oh, there's more. That's a horde. Oh my. That is not good. Alright, don't worry. I'll sort them out. Hey, stay away from my woman. I didn't even get near you. Goodness gracious. Everybody is so sensitive in this game. Alright, we're out. Rum, 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 rum. Beater mobile. Running over zombies all the time. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, we got some porta potties. We'll probably take those back to base. Probably make sure everybody doesn't get scared anymore because when you have a place to use the bathroom and you're safe about it, you're not going to be scared anymore. Don't worry. We're home. I'm coming home. This place is an outpost. We need to make that place an outpost right there. Just to increase our foothold. Green clear. See you soon. Got anything good? I'll show you when I get there. It's done. Found this while I was out. Ooh, what you got? Oh, you know, stuff. You're talking to, eh? So we got ammunition. We're pretty good on everything. We could use some more food, though. Need a little, you need a chat, girl? Don't worry. I know things seem bad, but we're gonna make it. And you're gonna help. Let's go. I can do that. Oh, is it that girl again? Oh, I thought it was the chick who had the words big dick on her shirt. But whatever. The one who I had to shoot Alan with. That was terrible. I never wanted to do that again. You been sleeping okay? I don't know. Just some people have been having trouble sleeping. You know, with the stress and all. Just wondering if you've been having the same problem. I'm just going to set up, um, what is this? An outpost here. Looks like a good spot for an outpost. Really? Are you sure? Let's make this outpost happen. There we go. Alright, so we're going to take up this entire neighborhood already. There's going to be no Zed. No Zed. Not going to crawl in bed. They're all going to die. Alright, buddy. Get in the car, please. Alright, Cam. It's time to go kill some zombies. Let's do this. But first, the male is dead. Let's do this. Oh, is this the house, really? Oh, so we can increase our foothold even more. Okay. Now we're going to kill some zombies the old fat. I've had enough of these. What in the world? What is that? Is that my bumper? It is my bumper. You zombie. You messed up my bumper. Therefore, you messed up my life. Things aren't as bad as they seem. Thanks. We should get moving. Lead on. Was that really it? I didn't have to get out of my car. Oh, that was great. Better. Might be here. Yeah. Look, you're not alone. Everybody's scared. Just don't do anything stupid, okay? Yeah. Okay, sure. Thanks for the pep talk. It helped. Good. Alright, so morale is high. That is what we always want. Now, I don't know how to find, like, these expert people. Do we have to, like... I don't know if we can train somebody or what. I don't understand. But we're going to try and upgrade these areas. Is there any way I can upgrade this? Improves recovery train or What is wrong with you people? The bridges are barricaded for a reason. Do not attempt to climb, destroy or otherwise circumvent the barricades. We have guard towers watching them and you will be shot without warning. 
I can drive by them extremely easily, so, you know. Okay, so let's upgrade this to an infirmary just so we can have a um, better chance of giving everybody back from injuries and whatnot. Let's see, can we do anything about this? Cook a big meal. Now that, vitality bonus, eight beds. Hey, it's okay. I'm a patient man and you're busy, but I really would like to talk to you. Oh, okay, let's go see what's up with this fella. Meet Ray Santos. Dos Equis. I don't know why. Whenever I... Okay, whenever I hear Santos from now on... I don't even know if I'll ever hear that word again. But Dos Equis comes to mind. Just saying. Alright. So let's head back here. Go see what... Oh! Can I car door this guy? Alright, I'm not even going to try that. That's a bad idea. I'm here to meet Dos Equis. Where is he? I've driven through many hordes just to get here. Dos Equis! Come on up here. We'll have a chat. Where are you? Oh, is this a strip joint? Please don't be a strip joint. Oh, good. It's not a strip joint. Kind of disappointed. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can find more building supplies. Energy drink. I don't have enough space for this. Oh, I forgot to drop off my assault rifle. Gosh darn it. How do I... Is there like a ladder? Okay, give me a second, Santos. You haven't given me clear directions. Is there a ladder? Oh, there is. Now, the trick is... Oh! that Look at Marcus here. This guy is a champ. Is he in here or is he at the very top? I'll go check out that area later. Alright. Oh, he is on the rooftop. Should probably read the mod it first. <laughs> oh! How you doing? Glad you made it. Hope this wasn't too far out of your way. I like to come up here sometimes to think really gives you a sense of the big picture, you know? Go ahead. Have a look. Take it in. My family's got deep roots in this town. My grandpa started with nothing but the deed to a few dozen acres of empty wilderness. He spun it into a lumber empire that put all four of his kids through college. My father took that education and gave back to this town. Miguel Santos was the first Latino mayor Marshall ever had. Did you know that? Community, you see. That's what matters, now more than ever. All of us together, doing our own thing, but helping our neighbors when they need it. Marshall's seen some pretty bad times, and some good. But my family's always done our part to help her through the bad and make the good even better. The way I see it, this whole thing is just another bad time. And I just know my daddy and granddaddy are looking down at me right now saying, Raimundo, you've got to do the right thing. So that's what I'm doing. Just helping out any way I can. You need supplies? I can arrange a train need a car, I can hook you up. Anyway, I've taken up enough of your time. You've probably got a lot on your mind. You don't need old Ray talking your ear off. Tell you what, though. Give me a little while to put something together. A sort of a welcome to the neighborhood present. I'll give you a call when it's ready. See you then? Whatever you say. Perfect. You stay safe out there. Well, if I've ever dealt with a mob before, which I'm sure this guy is indulged in. Gonna look around now. It means no favor. Even aid. Oh. I see something. Looks like an infestation. But even aid costs. Yeah, boy. This is gonna get bad, I'm sure. Supermarket. Oh, that's gonna be a good place. Anything else? I think we searched out most of this place. All right, well, let's get out of here. Is that just a giant M on the hill? It is. Oh, Marshall. Okay, that makes sense. I'm not even sure where Miguel went, but hey, whatever. It's not a big deal. He's not a... Let me off, please. <laughs> all right, so let's go see um, if we can go help out the judge at all. How you guys doing? You see... Wait, can I break through the back window? They are extremely vulnerable back here. What if I, if I can do this? <laughs> that guy's just like reading a book ever so casually. Let's see what we can do. Who's this? How's it going? I'm looking for Carl. Anybody seen him? The sheriff? Yeah. He went out about an hour ago. Said he was going to hunt down this feral bastard that's been stalking our patrols. I don't know how long it'll be, but I can tell you where to look. I owe you one. Find Carl. Oh, gosh. You always give me a laundry list, don't you, Carl? Gotta make me follow the tracks. Alright. 
So let's go find ourselves a vehicle and then we will get down to business. Got anything in here? Oh, a tavern. That's where you find America. Oh yeah, oh, crazy taxi. This is amazing. Yeah, let's just take things easy. Go find that feral zombie. I still don't know what feral means. Gosh, we should probably know that by now. Either way, it's a zombie, so it needs to be killed. Let's go down. Whoa, that's a big zombie. <laughs> I'm not gonna mess with those guys. Let's go see what we got. I guess we have to search through every house individually so we can't like do this extremely quick. So let's just go see what we got, shall we? Carl, Carl, Carl Strickland. Boy, where you at? Anybody in here? You in here, Carl? See, I'm looking for Carl. He uh, he was due over an hour ago, and uh, he's not here. So everybody help me find Carl. Now let's see what we got here. Find some building supplies. That do as well. Some junk. That's not exactly what I was looking for. Perhaps in this drawer of clothes, we'll find some building supplies. Food boxes. That always helps. I'll run this home. We'll be ready. Damn, I'm tired. It's all right, Marcus. Take it easy. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Time to move on. Here. Let me see if there's anything good in here. I'll search extra loud because I don't really even care. Nothing. That is despicable. Anything in here? Flares. We don't need more flares. And junk. All right. We're out. See you later, zombies. What if he, I wonder what he's doing in the shed. Anybody in here? I think I see him. Another man cave. There's a lot of man caves in this town. Ha ha! Uh oh. This could be bad. Don't worry about me. Just let me climb through the window. Come on, Marcus. Hello? You better be in here. Carl. Oh. Hey, wanted to talk to you for a sec. I got no plans on being number five, so keep your mouth shut and your eyes open. Oh boy, company we do. This could be bad, Carl. But first, let's scavenge for supplies. Search. See if we can't find any more stuff that we can get a scavenger out here to get some hands on. Junk, not exactly what I was looking for. Oh, I think we've seen a house like this before. Not a big deal, though. Tussin, Robotussin. Oh my goodness, numbs the pain. Typical over the counter stuff. Tastes like oh, that's great, but just knocks. Oh, so that's some hardcore stuff right there. All right, let's just give her this flare. We don't really need that. Get some Robotussin because Robotussin solves everything. Just put some Tussin. Another M14. I'm not sure why all these people are so armed, but whatever. <laughs> Should be careful. Might hurt yourself. Alright, so we found Carl. Now the real challenge is finding this feral zombie. Better look around some more. Nothing. I got an idea. Come on, Carl. Get in the car. We're gonna find him. Oh, so I had to search to find Carl and I had to search to find this feral zombie? What is this? I was about to take that swag mobile, but I don't think this guy deserves to be killed by the justice of an amazing car, so. Let's just honk it out, see if we can't find him outside anywhere. Anybody? I hear something in there. Whatever's in there doesn't sound right. Alright, this is gonna be bad. Oh boy. Oh, yep, that's him. That is him. That is definitely him. Wait, I got an idea. Carl, back up. Carl, I said back up now. Keep me covered. We are burning him. All right, there we go. He's on fire. Got you, you son of a bitch. What? I'll distract him. You bash his skull in. Then I'll answer any questions you want. I that he's not even flinching. Actually, you know what? I got an idea. Carl, give me a sec. It's time for some extreme prejudice. Get him out here. Where you at? I'm just gonna like unload on some zombies. Yeah, I gotta get him. Oh, there he is. There you are. Can I just like shoot once in the head? I was wondering what you could tell me about the girl at the Grange. Becca? I didn't cause her any problems with that. 
So you do know her. Yeah. She was a prostitute? Mm-hmm. Good kid, though. I tried to get her cleaned up and off the streets, but it never took. Anyway, she wants to call herself Becca now, and that's her business. Well, thanks for the info. Guess I got a decision to make. Look, I don't know what you're asking for, but not my advice. Some things ought to stay in the past. Anybody deserves a clean slate, it's that girl. I think we'll just leave it alone. Some 357 ammo. Medicine. It's always good to have some medical supplies, but we do have plenty. Alright, well, let's get home. Well, I don't, I don't think I'm going to tell Quentin. It's not right. I think uh, the sheriff was correct. New items at the courthouse supply locker. What's the situation at home? There's an issue with the infirmary. I know we wanted to make some improvements, but we're missing a few things. We can track it down, or find another way. But it'd be faster if you did a little scavenger hunt. Alright, well since we're out, might as well go check it out. I mean, we were just right over here. At least we are on this part of town. May, may, may us go back to like the old town, that would have sucked. Alright, let's see where we can find some of this super glue, or whatever it was. I forgot already. It just shows what kind of scavenger I am. I just like put my hands in things if it looks good. I take it. Look at that combat roll. Alright, let's see what we got. We gotta go through the cool way. They didn't hear a thing. Just search extra carefully. Oh, they heard me. Nothing. That's not what I wanted to hear. I should probably take it easy. It doesn't seem like zombies can break through doors, which is good. And as I say that, they break through the door. Alright, I'm just going to take things extra easy. Oh, this isn't going to work. Oh, jeez, combat roll. Seems like we missed an opportunity there. What are you talking about? I kill all zombies whenever I have the opportunity. Ooh, medicine. Why there's so many zombies in here? There are too many zombies. Stop it. I am sorting through all these guys. All right, do we have an energy drink? Oh, we don't. Get on my face, girl. Got my face. Yeah, gotta take a breather real quick. I have an assault rifle. Got that little present ready for you. Come on out and meet me when you've got the time. Jeez, so many presents and so many duties. This game is overwhelming. <laughs> All right, so we gotta find our good stuff. There we go. Hey, I've got no time for you. Whoa. Whoa, that was awesome. I don't even care. That was so cool. Okay. Enough about that. Let's get out of here. All right, we'll go see what Dos Equis wants on our way home. Where does he want to... Oh, he's over here. Hey, he's like right down the road. What do you know? Oh, sweet ride. Wait, is this a jump right here? Oh, that's a fence. You don't come home and rest a little. If he, if he set us up with, like, a tank or something. But watch, watch it be a truck that we already have. That would suck. Can we break through this? Oh, yeah. Let's see what we got. I'm just going to break through this window if you don't mind. Well, what do you think? It's a car. It's for me? Sure. Why not? I've amassed a fair little collection since this business went down. I can spare one for a new friend. It's all about people pulling together, after all. And, uh, speaking of pulling together, I wonder if you wouldn't be able to do me a favor. The folks out at the old Ballard homestead have been having trouble with one of their trucks. I happen to have some parts to spare, so I was figuring on running them out there. Don't suppose you'd be interested in taking this little beauty for a test drive? Happy to help. I knew I could rely on you. By all means, you drive. It's not too far. 